All of that is silly. Yes, it is. Of course, the Earth is flat. What? What you say? <laughs> that took me a second. It's like what? <laughs> Over here killing shit. A urinal cake? I don't know. <laughs> didn't say it didn't have to be good. <laughs> well, I lost my appetite. <laughs> what? <laughs> White chocolate 4.0. Hello. <laughs> You're on standby. How you doing? What? What? Your face is on the map. Oh, my face? Yes. That's weird. What? <laughs> what? A... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, what is this? Yeah, you can tell the vote to me, by the way. Oh, God. Ah! Help! Oh, no. I get there. Ah, ah. What, is, what is this? Oh, what is this? Oh, God! Oh, God, help! I was setting up the cameraman, and... Ah! Uh, white chocolate, where are you? Oh, my God! You dumb horse, where are you? Wait, 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 wait. I'm moving this boat away. Away from where? From the explosion. Yeah, oh, okay. Oh, God! Oh, that wasn't much of anything. What is that? What is that? I don't like that. What is this? Oh, okay. Oh, okay, I see how it is. Can it jump? Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's somebody! <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> uh, uh, oh no! Ah, you'll never take me alive! You muted? There we go. Welcome to Minecraft Power. Are you muted as well? Hmm? Are you muted as well or no? Everything is good. Everything should be good. Yes. These are four. <laughs> we are back to our railway. So much snow in this uh, tunnel. Alright, so, where we left off, I was at the skeleton farm. Fixing yes. all my stuff. And I was, I am currently organizing stuff. And... Okay, I guess let's do there. Where I am right now, that I got me a trident. There you go. Mending, impaling, loyalty, and there you go. Unbreaking. That's awesome. So now I have a spear, basically. <laughs> and I can throw at stuff and not have to worry about losing it. That's good. The only issue is that I really wanted. Um, I'm looking for stuff to throw this thing at. Um, 
what I really wanted was um, Riptide. Mm. But Riptide and was it Riptide and Loyalty or Riptide and something? Some of, some of the uh, enchantments are they they're incompatible. Mm, that's a shame. So, oh, there we go. Riptide and Chamling aren't compatible. Ah, that's a shame. And I have Riptide, but I don't have Channeling. Um, I want Channeling so I can... I don't know if it's just me or this weapon. Okay, it's the weapon. <laughs> uh, every time I right-click a uh, chest, the... Mm -hmm. The, um... <laughs> The trident goes into throwing mode. So it like flickers for a second. It's bugging me. You know you could push that card over here, right? Uh huh? You could push that. Oh, I didn't even know you were there. <laughs> I'm just trying to organize everything. Mm hmm. Trying to make it like as, like, as neat as possible. Mm hmm. So can you throw the trident taco? I want to see you throw it. Yeah. Phew. Oh wow. Oh that's cool. That is pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> so you That's what you get for showing off. Oh. <laughs> okay. Alright, I, 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 I can't go through these chests with this, uh... So with this trident weapons. in my hand. <clears throat> yeah, start all the way at the beginning and then work your way from there. Is that... Mm -hmm. I think I was working. Oh, that's what I was doing. Okay, I remember now. What were you doing? I was uh <clears throat> going to start the bottom of the rails, the ceiling, and one of the walls. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> The slabs should be there somewhere. Maybe I just look right past them. Slabs are right here. Stone brick slabs are right here. Uh, well, regular right. slabs. I don't know about regular slabs, but yeah. they might. Uh, they oh, they're in that chest all the way in the all the way on that side. The slabs that I was using, mm -hmm. they're all the way on the other side over there. They're right here. I got him. Okay. <clears throat> and then we're actually going to need some cobble. So. I'll see if there's any. Here they are. Stone slabs you wanted? Yeah. Yeah, here they are. Oh, they're in the front, in the actual wall? Yeah. Yeah. Do you, yeah, you can grab them. I'll put them back. Out this master shovel. 
Ah, uh, yes. Yes. Ah. Yes. Oh man. Look, just like butter. Oh. I'll worry about Kaba later. Uh, let's see. Starts here. Kaba. Or is it like, yeah, I'll do this way. Boop. <coughs> Oops. Alright, so <laughs> I'm about to get into build mode, so. <laughs> hey, Cortana. How are you doing today? I'm good. Just pondering the seasons. Fall. I thought that was you for a second, poets. Taco. Not so much with the school kids. What is your favorite season? Winter. Lucky you. Winter is coming. <laughs> Yay, winter. <clears throat> All right, what am I going to do about this part? I guess I'll use okay. the smooth and the sight, so. I think I'm going to, yeah. <clears throat> Oh, that's what we did before, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a number. Alright. <clears throat> hey, Cortana, roll a die. You rolled a four. Alright. How do I add a chest to a minecart? Uh, you have to craft it on the crafting table. Ah, okay, that makes sense. No, it doesn't, but sure. Yes, that one is done. <clears throat> Would you rather A, always have your clothes covered in cat hair, with no access to a lint roller, or B, always have your clothes smell like s intense cigarette smoke? Uh, cat hair. Because <clears throat> I've dealt so, with that. No, I'd rather have cat hair. Because uh, cigarette smoke is gross. I don't like cigarette cat smoke all that much. Gross. Yeah, but that's more understandable. That's like, oh, he has he has a cat. He has a very, uh, he has a cat that sheds a lot. That's understandable. Cigarette smoke is just like, uh, eh, he smokes. Smoking is bad. Smoking isn't healthy. But that's just me, though. I, I don't like the smell of cigarette smoke. I used to for some reason, but now I don't like it that much. I'm sensitive to certain types of pet hair, so mm. I can't do it. That makes sense. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like the smell of cigarette smoke. It triggers my allergies, and I just go sneezing all the way, like all over the place. <laughs> it's not like, very fun. What would you pick? Allergies or allergies? Uh, I'll go <laughs> with allergies. <laughs> I'd rather pick the one that, like, that's true, but um, I'd rather just have the cat hair. That'd be a lot easier. Man, I have to decide. I have two projectile weapons now. Like the right now, the bow is faster. Mm -hmm. But if I could put some, if I spend some time and get some levels, <clears throat> I can enchant some of the other, <clears throat> enchant some of the other, uh, 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 
tridents and um <laughs> and then merge them together mm -hmm. oh wait why didn't i get polished andesite i've got some on me as well i'm bringing them from the other chests Too much and too much polished andesite. If we use polished andesite slabs, mm. yeah, we need some accent. I like it how it looks now, though. Yeah, it'd be too it'd be too much of the same shade of gray. I have andesite here. If you want some, uh, there's some. I already grabbed some. Alright. Um, right. Hey, Cortana. Roll a die. Yeah. Hey, Cortana. Roll a die. You rolled a two. Organs of the digestive system. Uh, stomach. The stomach, large intestine, and small intestine. Um, the sphincter. <laughs> yeah. Um, esophagus. I was thinking that because that's the beginning. Yeah. Um, Let's see, what was the question? The parts of the digestive system. Organs. Um, major parts of the digestive system are salv salivary glands. Oh, okay. The pharynx. Pharynx, what's that? The pharynx is... Is the pharynx. The membrane lined cavity behind the nose and mouth connecting them to the esophagus. Oh. Uh, the esophagus. <laughs> the throat. <laughs> yeah, Hello, yeah, pretty deep much. India. Welcome back the to esophagus, the street. Uh, small intestine, large intestine, the stomach, uh, the rectum, uh, accessory di digestive organs, so like the liver, gallbladder, and pancreas. Okay. Yeah. Deep. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Um, <laughs> Deep says Salisbury glands. Hello, Deep. <laughs> Glad for tasting Salisbury steak. Um, okay. How are you doing this evening? Actually, Deep, I don't think you were here when we were working on the railway. I think you started playing when we were, like, working on the castle. Uh, doing good, working on this robot for decks at the moment. Nice. Let's see. You did some work on the railroad? Okay. Cool. Make sure I don't lose count that I'm adding these pieces. But yeah. Uh, yeah, the plan is to work, uh, build this all the way here, make that turn, connect it to the uh, castle, and then from there, start building a way straight to the spire. And then in like eight months we'll be there. <laughs> um maybe, yeah. We'll get there when we get there, I guess. Yeah. Uh, I'm asleep. 
Ready? I know. Time is flying. Uh, I keep moving my mouse to the camera, man. <laughs> Old habit. <laughs> on the castle nice gonna slap this eye on this robot oh, okay nice you can help bring some of the uh, some of the materials here uh, <clears throat> Choke on water. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> There's some stone over here too, so I can, if you ever need more um, uh, uh, slabs, you can come over here. Uh, like actual stone, stone or cobble? Yeah, stone. Oh. And I have uh, cobble as well. Okay, I need cobble. Yeah. I have, I have some cobble on me. I need to... Actually, I need stone bricks and stone stairs. So I can start making the entrance of this one. I'm gonna need some food if I'm gonna be running like this all day. Yeah. I recommend I not running, because that's what I've been doing. I'll do regular running, I won't be doing jump running, because that like destroys food. And I'm not in a race right now. <laughs> okay. You said cobble? Cobble? Oh, I have it on me. Give me one second. I'm just Okay. I see the uh Cobble San the... Lucas. No, I s <laughs> I see the uh railways moving. Give me one second, I'm just trying to Oh, I was pushing this one back in line. Okay. Right. Because he was being insubordinate. Yeah, let's just get rid of that for now. Okay. okay so here we'll... is some cobblestone, and here is some stone. All right. Let's see how much we got. Okay, that should be good for a little bit. <clears throat> what I might do is I might place the stone and break it. Because <laughs> we have tons of... Um, Stone. No, that's polished andesite. Uh, I'm not sure. <laughs> Make a decision. Uh, another piece of stone. We have a bunch of slabs. This should last us a little bit. Ah, that's what it is. Yeah, this isn't going to last us very long. <laughs> run out of it immediately. Cool. Oh, okay. Hey Cortana, roll a die. You rolled a five. <clears throat> what is your favorite post Thanksgiving dinner activity? Uh, Sleeping. Yeah, I was about to say, just recovering from a food coma. <laughs> um, yeah, basically, it's um, looking up all the sales. <laughs> As you're starting to pass out. Like that's a good sales. Well, so I would say, <clears throat> I'd say before I got married, I would just have my mom's house, and I wasn't planning on going anywhere. So I'm like, eat all of the food and then fall completely asleep. <laughs> um, As you do. Yeah. So now I have like three places I need to go to. Mm -hmm. So I can't just stuff myself and fall asleep because I got to drive us to the next place. So, <clears throat> what ends up happening is I go to one place, 
eat a little bit, go to the second place and eat a little bit. And usually the second place has the um, they have the magazine, the new the newspaper, mm-hmm. which is like I look at the newspaper one time a year, <laughs> and that's on Black Friday. <laughs> um, then. <clears throat> I need some more cobble. Uh, <clears throat> do you have more cobble? Uh, not on me at the moment. Hmm. I can tear down a mountain for you. No, we have tons of uh, left behind. You'll get your chance once we use up all this <laughs> other stuff. Ah, uh, yeah. There's. I have some, two cobblestone. Uh, two. Uh, a couple of on, on me. Okay. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, they usually have the newspaper, and that's where I start looking at all the uh, <clears throat> sales and everything. <clears throat> and I start planning my, my, my plan, start making my plan of attack. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm all the way at the end of the yeah. railway. Actually, Where's my minecart? Hmm. Don't we have a ton of rails, right? Yeah. Okay. We also have some uh, redstone rails as well. But there's two minecarts right here as well. Okay. Yeah, I think that's where... Okay, I'm going to grab one from there. So I don't have to keep running this path that's perfectly built and perfectly working. But, uh... Yeah, during Black Friday, I usually get um, some gifts for me, <laughs> and then I do some start working on Christmas shopping. We might as well. Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, uh. Here are some more cobblestone. Alright. Alright, this will last me about five or six minutes. <laughs> it's like this this thing is like one third cobble. Actually, I need to take a... Do you want your mine card as, mine card as well? Oh, yes. I'm so not cart. used to working on this railway. <laughs> oh, is it in there? Or? It's in there. It's in the big uh, chest. chest. Alright, cool. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I guess I kept it here and I didn't have the shovel. I'd switch out whatever the second tool was. <clears throat> Yeah, this year, same thing. It's gonna be... Oh, and then I'd go to my mom's house and then we'd play Wii games. And eat. Would you have a pizza party, or...? Pizza party's New Year's. Ah. But, uh, that always cracks me up for, for whatever reason. Mine's changed from uh, sleeping to planning for Christmas. Ah. Hey Cortana, roll a die. Five abstract artists. Picasso. Picasso, Salvador Dali. Would that be abstract uh, or would that be... Uh, uh, what is that word? Uh, I don't know. Uh, surrealism. Ah. Uh, 
maybe, yeah. I mean, uh, let me check. Um, abstract artists, you said? Yes. Abstract artists. MC Escher? Yeah. Um, uh, or would that also be classified as surrealism? Uh, he was more optical illusion artist. Yeah. Wazili Kandinsky is one of Russia's most famous artists and the founder of abstract art. His compositions have been iconic abstract art pieces around the world. Uh, okay. Okay. There is Bricks of the Castle. Abstract. I don't remember what I did with all those bricks. I think I... If anything, they're probably at the Ice Castle. It is t I, at the uh, Garga Farm. <laughs> Ah. Sleep it time. All right, more always. Um, three art movements which con contributed to the development of abstract art were Romanticism, Impressionism, and Expressionism. Picasso, there you go. Yep. Uh, Jackson Pollock. I, I was thinking that. Uh, Wazili Kandinsky, that was the founder. Mm -hmm. uh, Mark Rothko. Uh, not sure. uh, Piet Mondrian. Let's check. Um, yeah. Robert de la Une. Oh. Major Ping, thank you for the follow. Uh, oh, you thought you already followed me? That's that's all right, it happens. But yes, thank you for the follow, Major Ping. You are wonderful. You're one million and you're one of a kind. Thank you so much for the follow. I really do appreciate it. Welcome to my corner of the internet, and I do hope you enjoy your stay. Um, but yes, it happens. And those moments where you thought you followed someone already and just be like, oh, I thought I followed you already. But it happens. Um, trying to think. But. Diamonds are forever. Um, and then I'll take the ice to the castle. Hey, how's it going, Major Ping? How are you doing today? Bricks. What kind of bricks? Stone bricks. Uh, seeking more, yeah. That's yeah. That we are. Uh, we started doing that fairly recently, and it's been a lot of fun uh, for me, at least. But yeah, I like doing that kind of stuff. It's an off day for you. Well, I hope it gets better for you, Major Ping. I hope it gets better. <laughs> All right, this is looking actually pretty cool. Oh, the new area. <laughs> yeah. It's like you cross an area so much that it's like it just looks like familiar and all of a sudden when something's new, it's like, oh, it changed. Yeah.
<laughs> Hello. I was watching somebody's video. Somebody said something about a horse wearing gold armor, and I was like, "What type of armor? Gold? Gold? Oh, oh yeah." And I was like, "Why haven't I made white chocolate diamond armor yet?" So I'm gonna be doing that soon. <laughs> Where are the children from dying as often? Uh, where are the well, they, they're starting every time, like anytime we run into a lull. And you're more than welcome to give a question, too, Major Ping. If you have a question, you're more than welcome to give it. Um, but yeah, you are more than welcome. It just happens that just like every once in a while, we'll ask Cortana a question or a dice number, and then she'll give it to us, and then we'll just talk. But yeah, if you have a question, you're more than welcome to ask it. Yep. All right, do I have? Yeah, perfect. Ah, oh, crap. Do you want me to bring the stuff from the uh, uh, area that I picked off, I cleaned off, the mountain? Yeah, if we could get all that stuff to us, then okay. we should, we, that'll um, help us kind of replenish our supplies. Okay. Because um, I'm not far enough ahead to have like you and Deke whenever um, whenever he jumps in to okay. work on it. And then, yeah, do you want me to, what do you want me to fill them up, just... Uh, Hmm? Like in the chest, because there's gonna be way too many for that. Way, way too many, many way, for, way like, too many material for like all the small chests. How many? I, do you have three? I have three chests, but um, I, I'll make it up as I go, I guess. Three minecart chests. Yeah, in my inventory right now. So three chests and three minecarts. Yes. Um. Yeah, because I, I would say, hmm, just getting them here is kind of a, kind of a bit of work. Mm -hmm. uh, Major Pink says, name the three original versions of Jazz. This is region specific, by the way. Oh. Uh, oh man, what's her name? Um... Ella or Edda. I keep finding that name all across. Like whenever I do crossword puzzles, her name is crossed all was all the way there. But um, I don't know music all that well enough. But I'll check once I do this. I knew it from a cartoon. <laughs> they had a book of like really um, strange diseases. Mm -hmm. No, 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 or. or... Hydration time. Well, I had a bunch of vials with weird viruses in them, and one of them was a jazz, a jazz um virus, and mm -hmm. it was that person that you're trying to remember. Yeah. Otherwise, I would have no idea their name. He's over here. That's fine. Um, so there we go. Uh, 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 there we go. uh, yeah, there's a whole wow, that's yeah, I knew Jad. There was, there was, hmm. I want to say it was Earth at Kit, but I don't want to say that. Yeah. Um, jazz is characterized by swinging blue notes, call and response vocals, poly rhythms, and improvisation. Hmm. And it's good music too. Um, 19... <laughs> yes. 
<laughs> the 1950s saw the emergence of free jazz, which explored playing th without regular meter, beat, and formal structures. And in the mid-1950s, hard bop emerged, which introduced influences from rhythm and blues gospel and blues, uh, especially in the saxophone and piano playing. Model jazz developed in the late 1950s using the mode or musical scale as the basis of musical structure and improvisation. Uh, jazz rock fusion appeared in the late 1960s and early 1970s, combining jazz improvisation with rock music rhythms, electric instruments, and highly amplified stage sound. Yeah, okay. In, in the early 1980s, a commercial form of jazz fusion called smooth jazz became successful, garnering some significant radio airplay, other styles and genres around in the thousands, such as Latin and Afro-Cuban jazz. Uh, oh, New York style jazz, Chicago jazz, and Kansas City jazz. Interesting. Oh yeah, I can already tell that there's like a whole like variety of music from that. Uh, cool. Let's check. Uh, major. No, what am I talking about? New York style jazz. New York style. It would help if I could uh, type everything. I'm tired today. <laughs> um. Yeah. Ah, uh, what does the top of this look like? Yeah, that's... Is it stairs? Yeah, New York style was very standard when it came to music. Yeah, I can... I can yeah, New York is very, like... All the music from New York is very, like, standard and, like, very, like, gritty and, like, like... Like, to the point, I guess. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff here. Um... that never sleeps has music yeah. that never sleeps exactly um chicago oh, was where nice. heavy swing was utilized yeah I, that's interesting Boom. what was that these stairs won't place <laughs> sleep yeah uh where did my oh, I just okay. ah why only one You gotta crouch. Crouch and then do it. If you want more, you gotta crouch. Uh, this is dumb. Oh. Oh. There you go. You gotta, you gotta... <sighs> uh, Kansas City focused more on improv than the wing at the times. Uh... uh swing. Swing, yeah. More... Uh, on the improv and the swing at times. I, the typos, yeah, I can, I understand with, I understand you there, uh, Major. I am tired today, but yeah, no, I get it. Uh, um, but yeah, there's, it's always fascinating to me, like all the types of like music that's out there. Uh, I'm gonna have to. Okay, so I have a small modification. Yes. When, for the roof? Because for the floor, we're only doing one slab now to save on slabs because they take so long to craft. Mm -hmm. um, for the roof, if there's nothing above it, or actually, if, there, yeah, if there's nothing above it, like dirt or something like that, then yeah, still do one. But if it's open to the sky, we should do two. For? For the roof slabs. Oops. All right. If we did one, it'll look weird. <laughs> or not. You know what? I'm gonna look at I'm gonna try it and look at it. Yeah, keep trying, see what happens. If you like it and it works, keep yeah. You trying to do taco it's like every other stair i place is upside down can i get rid of this snow taco do we need snow or no no okay i can get rid of it perfect yes. 
awesome. We only needed snow for the first few minutes of the castle build, and then I was like, I hate snow. <laughs> We're using concrete. <laughs> um, but yeah, okay, that makes sense. But yeah, yeah, I love that. There's like I, there's so much. T there's variety of music is pretty awesome. Hey Cortana, roll the die. Five. Uh, going with them Thanksgiving questions, I see. <laughs> This is upside down. <laughs> no, no, no. No, no, no. I won't be able to tell which side's the front. <laughs> what was the best fall premiere of a TV show? Oh, boy. Um, it's going to be hard since I don't watch TV all that much. Index season three. Index, I guess anime related. I guess doesn't surprise <laughs> me. But um, <laughs> don't know why, but I can imagine your friend as having the weirdest face as he asked Cortana to roll the dice. Well, you can check him out yourself. <laughs> yes. Really weird over here. <laughs> I don't know. I guess I'm out of stairs. I guess when Lost was around. I guess I don't remember when Lost was around. Did they air? Did the show come out during the fall? I don't remember. It's been so long. There we go. All right. Up here. It's gonna be weird. Ha! Over the bridge and through the forest. Actually, over the tunnel. No! <laughs> okay, I don't need this right now. So I can keep this. There we go. Free follow for taco. Oops. Yeah, he he waits for the end. Oh, or thank you for the fire lad. Just troll prevention. I can totally understand that. There we go. That works. Yeah. That works even better. Perfect. There we go. Okay. Now slabs. Which I have plenty. <laughs> ah, I'm supposed to be trying one. Can I do this? Yeah, I can. Okay. Good. Yeah, I can't think of. I, all I can think of is TV shows. I I pay no attention to. I, yeah, I don't pay attention to any TV related things. Well, it's like even if you did find like there was a, like Lost or something, like oh my god, Lost is back. Like I never knew. I never paid attention to like. Oh, it's the fall, so these shows should be coming back. I never. Yeah, I never really it. like paid attention to that. It was like, oh, it's finally on. Awesome, let's watch it. Yeah. Okay. I hate it. Two on the top. Oh God, wrong button. Mm. Yeah, the only time I pay attention now is because I have a podcast about anime. Yeah. I need to know what season we're talking about. <laughs> Yeah, and that's that's kind of understandable. Right. What were some TV shows that you followed? Lost was for sure the one I followed like the most. Okay. 
I was like, I, I'm like that show at the time was just like, this is amazing. The ending kind of got a little out there, I guess, towards the end. And I think they were scrambling to like finish it up, I guess, but I don't know. I thought it was amazing. And I, yeah, but um, there was also Burn Notice. Burn Notice was pretty awesome. Okay. Uh, Did that have and... a bald guy in it? That's Blacklist, never mind. Blacklist, what's Blacklist? Oh, Blacklist was, no. Was that um, the guy, Robert California from The Office or Ultron from uh, Avengers? I have no idea. I, I forget know, his name. I don't know. Whenever those names pop up, I think of a bald guy in a trench coat. That's going to bug me. James Spader. There you go. James Spader. Is uh, you never saw Lost? Yeah, I mean, at the time, I thought it was absolutely amazing. And it probably still is, but um, I can understand why people have, weren't really into it. But yeah, it's I enjoyed it. For me, it was anti-hype. Oh, yeah, there was a lot of hype towards it. I Yeah, yeah there was a lot of hype. I don't know why, but... It's like when too many people love something, I'm like, no thanks. <laughs> and it's, it's a dumb, it's a dumb thing to go by. I don't know why that affects me, but it's just, I don't know. I guess it's just like crowds. Yeah, I guess. Like sometimes I like waiting and being like, just like waiting for a show to end and be like, okay, I can finally get into this and then just read all like the conspiracy theories and stuff like that mm -hmm. and like it's like oh i kind of thought that as well it's like oh that makes more sense that like some like for some something like that so would there be any show that you would like come couldn't oh is it you would participate in creating those theories with well right now i'm watching critical role it's uh, a D, &D show mm -hmm. and the community for that is amazing and they're on their like ses uh, second um campaign and the whole the subreddit every time like every time the show airs like every thursday and stuff like that it's just like everyone is just like watching intently and it's it's fun to be like a part of that stuff so i don't know okay so it's just you were just too young or not that interested in it or, yeah or the 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 where the where the theory crafting was happening was not as accessible as like reddit is now yeah and i uh when for lost there were forums but they weren't like as prevalent as they would be today. I don't think Reddit existed back then. Mm -hmm. Or if it did, I didn't notice it. But um, I only theorize for uh, is that Friday night at Freddy's? I'm guessing. Oh, Five Nights at Freddy's. Five yeah. Nights at Friday. Yeah, fr Five Nights. Yeah. <laughs> Friday Nights at Freddy's. It makes sense, but um, percent off. Yeah. Um, but I, yeah, that game looks pretty interesting. Looked ter terrifying, but I hate jump scares. <laughs> um, I can't do it. For me, I like I love the lore about stuff. Like I love like reading about it, even though like I'm never gonna play. I just love reading about the lore and just being like, oh, that makes that's interesting, and then just going from there. But very simple game. Yeah, from what the gameplay that I saw was pretty pretty amusing to watch. Just survive the nights, yeah. I have a feeling that's easier said than done. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I I need to play more jump scare games. I'm not. I'm a huge wuss when it comes to that type of stuff. My body tenses up too much, and like mm. I'll end up like hurting, like pulling a muscle or something. Uh, I can't do it. But I'll watch uh, Markiplier do it. <laughs> Uh, it doesn't tell you the lore parts, which what makes it so interesting. Yeah, I mean, yeah, you kind of have to go online for that kind of stuff, which is pretty interesting. You have to like ha like go to an extra step to do things, which is kind of interesting, depending on the person, I guess. Some people don't really like that all that much, but um, yeah. Okay, that's fine for now. Yeah. Um... Oh, it's not even online. It's within the game. That makes it even cooler. That's cool. 
Yeah, basically you would be you could beat the game and you could like I guess what is it Easter eggs or something like that? Easter that eggs, find, I guess files, yeah. That you would find that like explain a bit more of the story. Mm -hmm. But um Ah, uh, the first game had newspaper clippings that would reveal the pieces of lore. Ah, that's cool. I like when games do that. Actually, I think I do remember, like, that, the the game doing that or something like that. Like, people would find these clippings and just be like, oh, this is what happened and stuff like that. Like, some random person died and thing and now it's, like, stuck there forever and you can hear, like, some voice or whatever. But, I don't know. I thought that was pretty cool. Yeah, such as a news clipping discussing the disappearance of five children. Yeah, that stuff is interesting. Like when PT came out, like that playable trailer for that scary game and stuff like that. Yeah. I was just like, this is a game I'm probably never going to play. And I can't because it's gone now. But um, just reading about the lore and stuff like that it was like super fascinating to me. Like, this is why she's angry. This is why this happened. So, I don't know. It's interesting. Yeah. <laughs> I am a big wuss. Oh yeah, I'm a huge wuss. But and... you all right, Ray Ray? Yes. You breaking stuff? Yeah, I don't know. Like even thinking back to the whole Five Nights at Freddy's story, ah, I don't know. I just, I just start feeling bad. Uh, sad story. It's a sad story. Well, it's just oh, these so and so disappeared or so and so died. I'm like, oh, oh yeah. Uh, The other day, my boss came and he's like, "You've been watching the news? It's like the world's ending." And I'm like, "I can't. I can't. That's. I I can't follow the news. It's too depressing." Yeah, I'm with you there. Uh, or the rules of a star. Number one: Do not touch Freddy. Uh, interesting. Going back to <laughs> the um, the TV premiere thing, they kind of mm -hmm. spun off to the theory crafting. Um, there's one show, well, two shows. There's two shows, two anime that. Oh, there's I, some stunt slabs over here. Sorry for interrupting. Okay. But um, yeah, go ahead. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah, there's two two anime that I actually started watching with a group not watching with a group but like watching and then everybody at work had like watched their most recent episode and we all were able to talk about it mm -hmm. and that was the coolest thing ever yeah it's always really cool like talking with like with a show like talking about it and like to someone that like actually knows about it and just like oh you saw this too and it's like oh did you see this thing and just be like yeah and then you relate on stuff like that yeah isn't that it's kind of always... like water cooler talk or something like that yeah yeah there's only been two shows ever that i've been like that with and one's dragon ball z when i was in middle school and the other one was full Metal alchemist brotherhood mm -hmm. yeah for me i think it was lost because mm -hmm. I don't know, everyone was talking about it, so I could be like, oh, what do you think about this and stuff like that? And, um, don't, I generally, I, I think Lost was the only show that, like, I saw, like, straight through. And I think that was, like, the last TV show until, like, Netflix showed up. It was like, huh, I'll watch this instead. 
Oh, so did you uh, binge the whole thing, or? Oh yeah, I would. I would stay up and just like I would watch like every <laughs> Thursday, and my stepdad would get so, so angry with me because I had to do like chores, stuff like that. It's like no, I had to watch this show first, then I would walk down, I would do my cho- my chores. But it was just like, yeah, I don't know. I was like, I think that's the only time where I was just like, I need to watch every single episode. I don't care if it gets me into trouble. I need to watch the show. Wow. But yeah, and I don't think like now that we have Netflix and stuff like that, and like other like streaming services and stuff like that, it's just like yeah, everything's just on like, demand. There's no pressure yeah. about watching it now. Yeah. Oh, Even no. with like TiVo and stuff like that, when we had TiVo, I was like, eh, I can just record it later. And sometimes I would, and then sometimes it'd be like, eh, I'll watch it whenever I can get the chance. It's snowing. <laughs> um, was there a show that you had watched with your parents weekly? Um, I wasn't supposed to, but Nip Tuck was a show that I watched. <laughs> so with them. That was, no, with them. My mom was not happy about it, but my stepdad was just like, it's, I would watch, like, I would, I would watch it, but sometimes I would miss episodes. Because they would, uh, not, I didn't realize at the time, but they would watch ahead, and it's like, oh, they didn't have a show, they didn't have an episode today. They're doing like a break or something like that, and then I would look at it into it later. And it's like, oh, that one was a very violent episode. So, but I don't know. So but, they would like preview the episode and be like, oh, okay, this is gonna be okay, and then watch it together. With yeah. Everybody. <laughs> or watch kinda. it twice. Yeah. But that, that's, oh. that's cool. So they did like yeah. homework before. They like yeah. pre screened it for you. That's cool. Yeah. Um, for me, I it was, guess a lot, also... it was um, uh, Survivor. Survivor? Oh, the like, show? Yeah, like season yeah. one. Mm-hmm. Like when it first started. Um, I never got into that show. I know it's like, I know that like people like it and stuff like that, but I never like got into it all that much. I know there was like a kids version which was interesting like there was like a kids discovery channel and i wanted to be on it so bad but they were just like i don't know i never i always missed like the deadline or whatever uh but i don't know that would have been super interesting hmm. torches but, torches right. i came over here i'm like i'm missing <laughs> something i was like that's not a show i've heard <laughs> Are there any torches? Uh, I have a stack on me, but um. Cause I just need the tunnel to be lit up. Wait, was that coal? That is that is coal. Yes, it is. Okay. Do you want it? Uh, Taco, take the take the whole thing. Huh? Take the whole thing, uh, or take it from the take it from the bottom. Uh, Not from the top. Take it from the bottom. <laughs> Take this one instead of this one. Do you see it? Take this one instead of this one. I don't one. need all of them. Oh well. I don't need a, I don't need two hundred and forty torches. Um. If I'm lucky enough, then I will be immortalized in DC, Drum Corps, International History. If you go to watch their live stream in the movie theater, then I'll be on the movie stream. That's awesome, Major Ping. I've uh, <laughs> I went down that rabbit hole on a uh, YouTube rabbit hole of like drum corps and stuff like that, and like like drummers and stuff like that, and like that stuff is fascinating. Wait, what? Drum corps, like it'll just like it's like a competition where like not bands, it but just like, like you're saying drunk or. Oh, drum core. Okay. <laughs> drum core. That'd be interesting. Okay. But um but yeah, there's just like competitions that are just like these guys are amazing. Like drumline like, the movie? Yeah, drumline, exactly. Okay. But yeah, that stuff is fascinating. Yeah, whenever that movie came out, I was like, man, I wanna be a drummer. Yeah. Uh, 
a professional marching band for kids, just not in high school. That's true. That makes, yeah. I'm sure there's like a lot of like levels and stuff like that. Does anybody do, like, drumming like that on Twitch? Um, don't you follow that one guy that does drumming? Well, I don't know if he does it. Well, he does, um, like, just drumming the music. I'm thinking, like, I'm talking about drum, like, drumline style music. Oh, I'm not sure. I'm sure. I know there's a lot of musicians and stuff like that, but I don't know if there are, like, anyone that does that. That'd be kind of interesting. Uh, I know of one person who was a drummer for 2010 DC. I I don't know. What, oh, um, oh, for that's pretty cool. He hasn't been on Twitch. Uh, oh, no. yeah. What is this? <laughs> that's water. What? Just a pocket of water? It happens. Weird. Uh, that's cool though. There's a lot of cool stuff on Twitch, like musician wise. Let's just stay there for now. Stop coming. There we go. Oh, another one. <laughs> Cortana, roll a die. Four. Huh. Would you rather be able to choose winning scratch tickets but only win the two dollar ones? Or B, be able to choose the winning sports team, but only be able to bet two dollars. Um, I do the two dollar, the first one, because those two dollars add up quick. So you would buy like five hundred scratch tickets. I guess if they're only two dollars. Well, if they're if they cost two dollars, and then you. Pay two dollars. Like you yeah. Two dollars in. I feel like it would add up. You would just waste while. time. Yeah. I'd rather do you'd that. Like gain, like... You'd basically like gain one dollar at a time because I think they uh. I think they usually cost a dollar. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Hydration time. Time to return this ice and then we'll be. Oh, there's water. There's so much water in these walls. Yeah, we're fine. I think I would do the uh, the sports betting. Really? Because in there aren't there some things where you could do like ten to one odds or a hundred to one odds. So I don't know. I don't bet all that much. Because then you'd bet like two dollars, and then you'd win like a thousand or something like that. If that's the case, then I'll do the second one then, because that'd be sounds interesting. Um, I love watching you two at the same time. So awesome to see, and I don't mean that in a creepy way. I I think um, multi Twitch is pretty awesome in that sense, just because it's just like you can see and like and like just to see like people doing everything. But uh, it's not that really 
Uh, put them on the other side. Well, right now I'm just lighting it up on my way. I'm just going. Yeah, but as I'm working down, it's just gonna wash them all away. Oh, well. <laughs> I'm going to the castle, so I'll be right back. Oh yeah, that's cool. You can see the uh, castle on the way. Oh yeah. Um. So I have a very big decision to make. Okay. It's not really that big of a deal. Good night. Night. But it's kind of like a. Basically, I'm going to have to do a bunch more experimenting in order okay. to, get it to um, get it to work properly. What are you thinking of doing? Um, so, over the last two days, the first night, I set the guy in the thing and then the got up in the morning and checked him. 11. Yeah. For what? The Aquarium of Doom? Yes. Ah. Got 11 lanterns. I'm like, hey, there you go. That's good. That's Ish. one third of what I thought <laughs> was assuming I was going to get. So then I let it go. And then I came back after work, checked on it again. None. Oof. Ouch. So I'm like, okay. Well, the last time this happened, I, um, right outside of my view. There was like 400 dolphins and 200 drowned. And of course, I'm exaggerating, but there's like just a cloud of mobs, all like frozen in suspended animation mm -hmm. because they spawned in that area where they don't move. Mm -hmm. And because I just sat there, it was just like boop, 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 boop. And the longer I was going to wait there, the more mobs would spawn. Mm -hmm. So, um, after I came home that day, I was like, okay, this is some, something's wrong again. So, I started swimming around the water. And then I swam to a new a area behind me. Because mm -hmm. whenever if you load into the game and just stand in one spot, then... Um, Says, gotta go grab a bite of steaks. Hope to see you guys later. All right, we'll be off for another hour. See you when you get back. Um, yeah, so if you stand in, uh, if you spawn into the game and just stand in one direction, nothing in your peripheral or behind you will load in. Interesting, except, except for like locations of mobs and then as soon as you turn around and the world loads in you still don't see them until you get in until they get into the render distance and then once they get into the render distance then then they uh materialize and like fall onto the ground um so i, <laughs> I started swimming over behind where i was standing where i was afk and um all of a sudden, I started seeing a bunch of bubbles, and I'm like, "What?" The? And then a, bu a bunch of dolphins materialized, oh, and no. it was at least a hundred dolphins. And I was like, "Whoa!" And then there's like ten squids, and then I look down, and there's like fifties drowned. And I'm like, "Oh Yikes. no!" So instead of it, the game loading in, uh, instead of the game loading in the. Uh, the uh, some of those materials, what you could do is take them to the castle. Okay. Cause um, I have some item frames on some of the um. On some of the chests, and then on the opposite side, there's like nothing but chests. Okay. So like for the stuff that we don't really need, like we don't really need dirt, we don't okay. need gravel, and like all the other stuff that's not part of the um railway, then we can go ahead and store all that stuff there for now. Sounds good to me. Um, I think I was gonna fill up every all the railways, rail carts that I had with chests, mm -hmm. and well, then move on. 
Well, if you think about it, the stuff that we're going to be that are going to be in the chest is stuff that we can push along with us. Right. So I'd say that put makes the, sense. Yeah, like the polished andesite and stuff like that in there. But um, like for dirt that we're not really going to use that much. Yeah. Maybe dirt we will, but like um, I don't know, like stuff that we won't use, like fences or. I don't know. We ha we have like eight chests full of dirt, so we don't yeah. really we don't really need any more dirt. Okay, I will take this to the uh, castle then. Yeah, put it in that little warehouse. Um, so yeah, so I started swimming, and then I was like, okay, well this is too dangerous. Let me go get on top of this island, and I um I swam to the. T <laughs> I swam and stood on the island. And then I look past the island to the shore. 50 zombies and skeletons and and spiders and creepers <laughs> and endermen. And I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> that sounds... Oh, what? All that spawning, spawning, spawning stuff sounds awful. Like, I just like... Yeah, instead of the game spawning in what I'm look where I'm looking... It's spawning everything behind me. And it's spawning everything that's like hostile land mobs. I'm like, no. <laughs> if you that's the opposite do... of what you want. Yeah, I'm like, if you were going to do that, I might as well stand on the other corner of the uh, Guardian Farm and then just wait and then turn around and there will be like a hundred Guardians and they'll just all fall into the water. And hopefully not zap me because I would instantly die. But um, yeah, it was a disaster. So I spent a few minutes. I was like, all right, well, these guys have to be gotten rid of because I think the the they say the hostile limit is 70. But I think that's for Java. I don't know what the hostile limit is for Bedrock since it's right. written in C++ and they said it's like certain things are better but not really or not all of them um so i don't know what the limit is if it isn't the same but either way i was like I, there's too many hostile mobs behind me in my in the area of the game where i'm at so i gotta get rid of these guys right um so i spent like 30 minutes like He's like, hey, zombie. And he's like, rah, and I kill him. And then I'm like, okay, run. And I'd like just pick them off one by one <laughs> until most of them were gone. Um, and then I was like, okay, now I got to go underwater. And I picked off all those drowned. And then I saved and quit. Jumped back. Uh, well, I went back to my the, um, AFK area, the AFK chamber. And then, um, and then I went to, um, yeah, then I saved and quit. And then I loaded the game up fresh with me staring right at it. And then it started working. So then that night I left it and I didn't want to check it in the morning because I didn't want to be in a bad mood before I go to work. <laughs> <laughs> so I waited till I got home and then it's like 30 and I'm like, okay. not bad. That's it's just gonna be thirty a day, so we need seven sixty. So that's like, Eesh. that's twenty four days. I don't really know what to do. So my decision is, do I go into creative for the first time ever? Mm, I would say no. And get him. <laughs> Or just keep the so game. do you want the sorry do you want the dirt in the castle yeah we have we already have a ton of dirt so okay that makes life a little bit easier base wise yeah Put you guys over here for now you need some of the dirt that we do have you could probably, you could um you could take some of that out of there out of the mine carts or yeah, out of the that's out what of I'm the, doing. Yeah. Major Pink says, uh, C plus plus, how familiar I am with you. Uh I took a coding class and I think it was just 
I don't remember what it was, but it was super fascinating. But I finally got all the jokes where it's like, it, like everything works, it's great, but uh, nothing works. It was like that we forgot like a parentheses or something. Yeah. Just like you have to like scroll down, like look through all the code and stuff like that, which which was interesting. It was like, ah, I finally get this. Yeah. It's like you never got it right on the first try or something like that. I don't know. But yeah, coding can be. It was fascinating, and it was just like, and just like, ah, this is how everything works. In terms of like websites and stuff like that. Oh, you did HTML, or did you be? Uh, I think I just did HTML. I don't remember. It's been a long while. Okay. But just coding in general. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but it, everything applies. But you said websites, so I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> well, yeah, we made websites as well, but oh, okay. Um, we used we used uh, Dreamweaver, I think. Yeah, I remember that program, WYSIWYG. Right. Um. My code does not work, and I don't understand why. Um, yeah, for Creative Power Hour, I plan on working on an app eventually. Mm -hmm. But, uh, I have some other stuff in the list before I can get to that. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, I took, I can't remember if we had just an assignment that had coding in it, or if it was a... Cause I can't think of any other assignments I did if it was a coding class. But mm -hmm. um, every time I see something that has coding in it, the the example that they always use is like "Hello World." Mm, yeah. Um. But yeah. Yeah, I think I wrote like a small. I don't know if I did like a program that like did a math equation for you or something like that interesting but um yeah i had a class that did some coding um i don't really know what to go like i thought prob it'd probably be vizio because that's how you can um that's how you can make apps using uh what is that uh Azure, yeah. Microsoft has this platform called Azure, which is like their servers, their um, cloud and server system. And every year, like every year, the three, the three big programming companies, Microsoft, Apple, and Google, they always have a con, they always have a developers conference. And I always listen to it just because I'm curious. I like to learn. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, they're always those conferences can always be super interesting. Um, uh, Text-based situations are the easiest to program, hence why they use that as an example so much. Keep it savagely, keep it savagely simple. Yeah, I've always, I've always learned it as keep it simple, stupid. But that I was about to that. say that I was like, I've never heard it that, put that way. Yeah, but yeah, keep it, keep it savage, savagely simple. Yeah. But yeah, I've heard it. Keep it simple, stupid. But work smarter, not harder. Oh yeah. Um. But yeah, it's like there's there's device conference or device events that I keynotes and stuff like that that I listen to from all three, and mm -hmm. then there's developer co developers conferences that I listen to, and um. And then there's the game conferences and stuff that I listen to. And, uh, hey, hey, how's it going, guys? Dude, Dude everything's normal again. <laughs> horses are horses. This is great. Uh, in martial arts, we use keep it savage, decent. What kind of martial arts do, do you do, Major Ping? I used to do Taekwondo, uh, I, way back when. I did karate. Well, I, 
<laughs> Tore right uh, before the, oh no right before my mom was like let's go play kickball together at the park and i'm like we never go do stuff like that and i mess up my foot <laughs> uh, man can't play kickball can't do karate anymore <laughs> i was in taekwondo that's the one i did that was... yeah i did i got up to yeah. I think the red belt before stopping. But yeah, it was a lot of fun. I especially love like like defend like defending stuff and like breaking boards and stuff like that. That was always fun. I thought she was sparring. Breaking bones. I was like, oh yeah. Was breaking people's me. bones. <laughs> Using nunchucks. <laughs> Indian burns, you know. All the things. We got the nunchucks, the Indian burns. Oh, so I did Taekwondo, Jiu Jitsu, a little Shinduro, and weapon. Interesting. Wow. That's cool. Yeah, I've always been fascinated by like weapons training because we did a little bit like with like fake knives and like fake guns and stuff like that. But like it was just like it was super fascinating to be like, oh, that makes that makes sense, or like not makes sense, but just like, oh, that's how you do that. I guess. But, <clears throat> master at the sword. Interesting. I. I'm a master of the taco. <laughs> Very e efficient at eating tacos. Uh, yeah, I was about to say I'm very efficient at eating food as well. But tacos pretty, are good as well. Pretty good. Pretty good at that. Been doing it for a while. I've gotten really good at it. Um, I'm on a mission. And uh, I will let you guys know. I'm going to shear every well, sheep. Do you I have a bed across. by any chance? Oh, you know what? I don't. <laughs> uh, hold on, I'm running back to where there's a bed. Sounds good. Uh, Ironically you enough, I want to fight in 1.46 seconds with a head strength. Fascinating. That's that's fun. I always like watching people fight, and like when they're like when they're good and stuff like that. When each person is good, it's always fascinating to be like, oh, I wonder who's gonna win this fight. But yeah, whenever we sparred, I was always just like, I always try not to go with like the best person there. But he always, my instructor always put me with the best person there just on purpose. <laughs> and I was always just like, uh, I'm going to get my kick tonight. All right. Made it so deep. What are you working on right now? Uh, before, oh, before I came in here? Oh, no. You said something about shearing sheep. Oh. Well, uh, it's it's a it's an act I call the shearing, and uh, it's when I shear every single sheep I come across. Alright, so N jump on the railway and head over to us. Okay, but I don't have a cart. Hold on, let me get a cart. Yeah. Uh, I always consider myself the worst person there, so I can play pay close attention. And watch how other people that's what i tried to do but my instructor i guess was just like all right one <laughs> he's like i know you're better than this come over here and get beat <laughs> i don't know and i i had no problems with it i absolutely loved it but at the same time i was just like while i was waiting this is like man i hope i don't get this person and then i did it's <laughs> like but you know what i don't have any stuff Where's the yes. mine card? Um, so you put everything inside of the warehouse? I did? Yes. What is a cow doing on the... Thing? Okay, so the warehouse... Yeah, towards the... All the way to the right, there should be two torches um, at the bottom of the um, sorters. The first torch... Oh, the yeah. Mine. And then the one to the right of that should be yours, and all your stuff should be there. Okay. Let's see. Huh, this is. I don't know how to follow directions. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now I'm just looking at every chest with a torch on it. There should be just two. Oh. Okay, so that's yours. Here we go. There's my cart. My gold helmet. I wish I could just like. Major Ping, play. thank you for the host. 
for those of you that are watching on from Major Ping Chen from Major Ping's channel. I'm Chosen Chosen One. Welcome to Minecraft Power Hour. Uh, we stream. Uh, I stream with Taco Monday, Wednesday, Friday, um, and sometimes Saturday. But I mainly I also stream Minecraft as well. But I've been venturing into other games like Skyrim and Mass Effect and all those other games. Ooh, um, but yes, welcome Effect. to my channel. I do hope you enjoy your stay. But yes, right. thank, cool. thank you for the host. All right, I'm going. Uh, I'm going to the minecart now. I got, I got my jazz back. I got my jazz hands. <laughs> um, um, what direction? What direction should I go? Uh, back towards the ice castle. Yes. Yes. Sweet. Thanks, guys. And away we go. I don't know what we should do about this ravine down here. What? There's a ravine that like starts under the tunnel and like it goes to the castle. It goes like part of the way over here. And I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> because we're going to have to... I guess glass. I guess I could just treat it just like... Well, no, because we're not in a tunnel. When it's out here, I don't know what to do. I haven't thought of it yet. So if we were if we were in a tunnel, it'd be glass. Uh, Major Pink says, in jazz, there's no such thing as jazz hands, only jazz fingers. <laughs> Ooh, there's a bunch of sheep over there. They're so lucky. They're so lucky. Uh-oh. Boom. Yeah. Okay, I guess I'll go ahead and start Thanks. setting up the pattern. So, this came dun, 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 I have plenty of cobble. Man, if you move your head while you're on a minecart, there's this weird, like, <laughs> break in the sound. It's crazy. Do you mean, uh, glasses, Major Pink, or what are glisses? I'm guessing those are gotten what you mean by our glasses. Something glistening? Uh, yeah, I think it's jazz related, I think. Ah, okay. Oh, that sheep was so close to the tracks. Oh, this one's going to be, oh, oh, oh. No, get sheared. And what, then he crosses. The yeah. Yeah, I'm sharing everything, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't even know how I got them, but, but now that I got them, they're not going away. He can't be stopped. The sharing. Uh, listen to Rhapsody. Uh, glide up to ungodly notes without hearing the separation is called the bliss. Oh, interesting. I did not know that. I had no idea that was a thing. That's cool. I'll have to look into that. Oops, 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 oops. There we go. Mm. Uh, okay, here. I'll have to listen to that after uh, I stream. What happens if you shear a pig? Do you do uh, I think you'll just end up punching him in the butt. <laughs> oh, poor uh, guy. On the trumpet, you have press valves. Literally glide up the notes. That's cool. That's pretty cool. I play the saxophone, so I don't know about that jazz. <laughs> I've played the clarinet for like a week, so I know basically everything about clarinets. I play yeah. the recorder, which is the best instrument. Yeah, everybody knows how to play that. Never, ever sound good. I never, ever made that sound like anything. I was like, why are we doing this? <laughs> yeah, I was never, I was never a good musician. Or I didn't have enough, like, I didn't really, this is like, I thought the same exact thing. Like, this is dumb. Why am I doing this? 
I, I like playing the saxophone and the piano, but the recorder, I was like, I don't understand. <laughs> Sounds like the same honking note, note every time. <laughs> I don't feel myself progressing. Honking. I just make the same thing over and over again. <laughs> Was it, isn't that the one? It's like a big horn and it honks. No. <laughs> it had, you had to wrap it around your body. It was like a contraption you had to get into. Yeah. What? I remember that one. Uh, I played the trumpet for eight years. That's awesome. Uh, still wanting to play if I wasn't, if it wasn't for school uh, workload. Yeah, I can definitely, school kind of takes over like activities and stuff like that you know you know what uh, instrument i always wanted to play but never learned was the uh violin mm, the yeah the violin sounds super interesting the violin nice. would be so cool to play man i never learned though hey what's up skeleton it's pronounced similar to bliss but with the g in the beginning ah uh, bliss interesting uh, i don't remember why i came over here if it's for dirt, I have a whole bunch oh, for you. Oh. You you need some wool? I got some wool. Stoves. Oh yeah, Stoves. those those are in the uh, chests over there. I haven't had a chance to get to get oh, them. Okay. Stoves. Uh... And if you want, no, no, no. Hmm? No, I was gonna say you can help me bring some dirt, but you probably don't are have the, any inventory. Are there the chests? No, like. No. Yeah, but are there chests? Are they in the? Are they? They're in the, the chest. They're the real. They're yeah. there too. Okay. Yeah, the dirt and the. Uh... I'm trying to get ahead of you. Me. Yes, Minecraft master. <laughs> I mean, I'm kind of distracted with all this organization stuff, so. Yes, that's you're what I'm doing trying a... to get ahead. <laughs> you are doing a pretty good job of it, I guess. And I'm like, okay, cool, and I can do it, and then two minutes later, you'll be done. <laughs> Wrong. I would love to learn the piano. Honestly, not just not as disciplined as before. Oh, yeah, man. I can definitely agree with you there. I, I was I I've thought about like the piano, maybe the violin. I've always wanted to do like the uh, either the saxophone or trombone. That's always been an interesting thing to learn, I think. But I don't know. Dude, yeah, the drums would be interesting. Dude, I always wanted to learn the drums, but I never did. <laughs> Even when I was like in a punk band in high school, I played the bass guitar because whatever, it was like the easiest to pick up. And my friend already like knew how to play the guitar. Oh, but the drums, man, the drums are always like the most fascinating. Wait. They're all the way in the back, Taco. Oh, okay. You're looking for furnaces, right? Yeah, they're all the way in the back. Oh my god, this is the longest railroad Just... ever. They're 18, there's, yeah, there they go. Were there a, it's a, bunch, noon. a bunch of chests in one of these chests? Do you want chests? Yes. Okay, well, I saw uh, a bunch. And I can't remember if they were here or in the castle. There might be at the castle. Oh, okay. Because I have two railway chests well, if you want them. Oh, I think it's time to sleep. It is. Oh, jeez. Uh, 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 I would channel anyone who tries to touch my horns. Yeah. Um, I have a friend, or I had friends back in high school that were super protective of their instruments. Hold on, wait. No, there's a creeper here. I can't do it here. Oh. Hold on one second. Hello, Charlie the Cadet. How's it going? Uh, Charlie, I can... long time to see. I can only be here literally for 60 seconds, but would like to express my regards and say hi. Have an excellent stream. Well, thank you for stopping by, Charlie. Thank you for using your 60 seconds on me. But yes, hopefully everything is all right with you. Um, but yeah, thank you for hanging out for a while, and thank you for the bits. I really do appreciate it. Taco, you're almost gone, uh, pit boss wise. Oh. Heh. <laughs> okay. All right. I think I'm going to save space. Hold on. Oh, no, 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 Nope, there's a spider here. Golly. Steve, you're everything. not having a good time. Well, I mean, I'm having a good time. I just I don't want to be a hold. I don't want to hold up the line. Pow, 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 pow. Got him. Okay, I just need to... 
There's the bed. I want to make sure there's nothing gonna kill <laughs> did me. Did you beat him with the bed? <laughs> I did. I punched him in the face with the bed pole. The bed. Look the headboard. There you go. Oh, hey, that respawn point. Okay. Oh man, I forgot which way I was going now. <laughs> Wait, no, no, I didn't. I'm going towards the water. Man, it's so good the water's here. Uh, I'm afraid my audio is broken, so I'll watch what's in back later. Just wanted to say, okay, uh, you're still here. I have a wonderful evening. Well, I hope you have a wonderful evening wonderful. as well, Charlie. I will Everybody see you later. Charlie Bucket. <laughs> really want this chocolate factory. Nobody ever goes in. Nobody ever comes out. No way in, no way out. <laughs> Crunk along, dunk of the ingredients. Don't ask about the secret ingredients. Dude, <laughs> Futurama is so good. <laughs> I love Futurama. Yeah, it's like I one of the best cartoons ever. Watched maybe two episodes. You need to watch about 200 more. <laughs> you, you're missing a few. Oh, they're so good. One do, one do, tree taco. <laughs> but, um, Cow time. Deep, have you seen um, Disenchantment? Oh, yeah, Disenchanted. Oh, Disenchanted, yeah. It. Yeah, I couldn't get into it, man. Uh, yeah. I watched like four episodes. And I was like, what the heck? And everybody's like, no, 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 watch it again. And I'm like, no, man, like, no. I feel the exact same way. I stuck it through, and it was all right. Like, I understand, like, they're trying something new. Something yeah, like yeah. That. But, I don't know. I, it, I I look forward to seeing the second season. Like, the things they did, like, in the first season were interesting. But, I don't know. It was definitely, I don't know. I like Futurama a lot feel more. Yeah, see, it doesn't feel like Matt Groening. Like, it yeah. feels like he put his name on it and a bunch of writers are in a room writing a show and it's, like, got comedic timing, but, <laughs> like, all the jokes seem disconnected. Nothing seems to be, like, saying anything. Like, there's no bigger message or... Yeah. You know, bigger, there's no bigger build to a but joke. It seems, it seems a lot like Seth MacFarlane, which, don't get me wrong, I love American Dad and Family Guy and stuff, but, like... Futurama had heart, like it was just yeah. a really touching show, but uh, I don't get that from this new one. I'm like, this is just, this is just money grabbing. Yeah, and I can understand, like somewhat, like it's the first season, so they do have time to grow. But yeah, true. But Futurama took off from episode one, like it was, yeah. it was banging from the first episode. Like that's true. That show was gold. That show was so good. Yeah, and even though it did get canceled, like. Twice, but it, they <laughs> finished it off. They finally finished, like, tied it off with a bow and everything. Yeah. I can't was... get over that show. I love it. Oh, the yeah, snow. Hopefully, though. hopefully yeah. they do, like, a better job in the second season. So... Like, did you watch it the whole way through? Uh, Disenchantment? No, I only made it to, like, the fifth episode, man. Oh, yeah, I can see that. Yeah. But I wanted I did to like finish. it, too. Yeah, yeah I, did, I did try and make it farther than just watching one. I was like, I don't know. And then I, I kept, as I kept going, I was like, man, it's just like, it's almost getting worse. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I agree with you there. But, but it does get better, but it's just like, it's very meh. It's kind of a slow climb. Yeah. It's one of those types of shows. You guys got any sheep out here? No. There's a sheep by me where I am. No. Okay, hold on. Let me go talk to him. It's the shivering. Where is it? You know sheep out here. It be smart. He ran. He ran because he knew the shearing was upon him. Oh, I need crafting tables too. Deep right there. Oh yeah, cause it's gonna be cold out here for you this winter. Thanks, Juan. Yep. <laughs> I'm gonna go stand on that mountain over there and look for more. So the Hey, what's up, man? <laughs> <laughs> um, this tunnel right here is ready. For the next layer? Yes. Alright, hold on. Let me get some supply. I don't have any uh, stone. Is it in that chest there? Um, is it all back here? I don't know. 
I don't uh, see any more shit. Shilling. Don't you mean shining? Do you want us to get sued? That yeah. I haven't I haven't looked I haven't looked. I haven't watched the show in a while, but I do look I do I keep meaning to do like a whole like rerun kind of thing. Just to binge watch. The shearing. Um oh, that's a polar bear, you can't shear them. And I don't think he'd want to. I don't think he would like that. All right, uh, Taco, where do I go back the way I found you? Yep. Okay, hold on. I'm grabbing. There's no supplies here. Damn. Hey, um, Juan, did you move the polished? Um... No, they should all be there. Okay. Okay, here it is. Yep. Um. Right, everything should be here except for gravel. I think except for co cobblestone. Yeah, I'm gonna get that stuff in a minute once I'm done moving all the Oh dirt. my god, so sorry. Oh, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> I'm gonna throw some exit you, exit you, exit you. Alright. Alright, where do you want me? Where do you want me? I don't have any supplies, by the way. Hey, right, yes, all the supplies are over here. Oh, okay. I was like, there's nothing in that chest back there. Except for these shears. Yeah, so if you look at the walls, you're gonna need slabs for the floor. And instead of doing two two um, slabs, we're just doing the upper half slab. Okay. So we, get, so we can get our slabs to last longer. Okay. So, um, most a lot of these are empty because one's transferring these out, and then he's gonna use these to gr bring some more stuff. But um, oh, okay. Yeah, you're nice. gonna need the. Polished. Yeah, you don't want sandstone in these chests, right, Taco? No, we don't need sand right now. So. Just anything that's usable. Yeah, we're, we're gonna save all the sandstone for the uh, pyramid. Polished diorite or? Uh, for the stuff that's on the walls. So, um, if you look straight ahead, you should see polished granite. Um, polished granite. And then next to it um, is polished andesite. If you look at the actual wall. Okay. Yeah. And then you're gonna need um, cobblestone, which we don't have right now, so you'll skip that part. And then you're gonna need slabs, which are stone slabs. Okay. And that's for the roof and the ceiling. Okay. I mean, so... for the floor and the, and the ceiling. For the roof and the ceiling. Gotcha. And then you should uh, drop the scissors off in the chest if you want. What scissors, man? <laughs> it's the shearing. Um. Uh, and to your left, you can see cobblestone, cobblestone, peasant stone, cobble, children crying, cobblestone. Children crying. <laughs> I'll have an order of that. Wait, none of this is diorite, right? Diorite, right? Yeah, no diorite. No diorite. I said no salt. No salt on the margarita. Uh, okay. Polished andesite, though. That's yes. the... That's going to be a thing. Is that? The keyboard is acting up, and I'm not happy. Uh -oh. I've been working on it. Uh, uh, I don't have any cobblestone, though. Yes, cobblestone we don't have right now. We use oh, okay, so just all, everything. We to make slabs. Wait, but where are the, where are the slabs? They're in, that, they're in the farther chest. Farther chest. Oh, the one way down here. Oh. Uh, Opinion-based question. Favorite animal and why? Uh, like just real animal? Yeah, real animal. Um, mm -hmm. Or fake animal. Dog. Um, Dog. I was thinking octopus just because how cool they are. Bro. <laughs> you don't even know. That's my favorite animal ever, man. <laughs> yes. I'm with Juan on this one all the way. Hey. Octopus is the best creature on the planet. Well, you know, humans kind of got it going on, but but octopus Octopi are pretty cool. Yes, I'm gonna I'm go with dog. But yeah, I mean, I, there's like so many things that they can do, and there's like so many varieties, and like some that are huge, some that are small, and like some that it can yeah. kill you, and like within a second. And just like I don't know, there's like so much you can like. There's so much to learn about them. I don't know. That's always been fascinating. Yeah, they're pretty great. They're pretty yeah. great. When I was younger, I wanted to be a marine biologist, and octopus, sharks, and the deep sea were like the things that I wanted to look at the most. 
So that was that was. Oh, who lives in a pineapple under the sea? <laughs> Juan, Bob. I thought you were gonna say when I was younger, I wanted to be an octopus. Oh, oh man, no. dude, that's that's what I would. No, I, be, I still want to be an octopus when I grow up. Well, that's exactly. a pretty lofty goal. I don't think. I don't think I'd be want. I don't think becoming an octopus is very feasible. You could be anything you want to be. I have no regrets if I could be an octopus. That's what I would do. I wonder if they have an octopus onesie. I'm sure they do. I'm sure it's like would it be a onesie? Too. Could it be an eight Z. I don't know. That doesn't work at all. <laughs> 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 That wasn't even nearly clever. <laughs> All right. If you had Octazy or something like that. Octazy. Yeah, there you go. Octazy. Um, I just need... Oh, man. Just got my surprise. Did we do hydration break? If not, oh, hydration no. time. Wait a second, what the? I spilled water you? all over myself. <laughs> you, you're real excited about your hydration, that's all. <laughs> okay. The sharing! Okay. okay. So. Alright, so. Oh, hey, what's up? Yeah. So. I was about to start saying that too. <laughs> so, you can do the, um,. The wall. Yes. Okay, but no cobble because we don't have that. Yep. And then also, do you have a pickaxe? Uh, yes, I do. All right. So over here. It's just stone, but these you three. Want to break yep. this. Yep. Yeah, these three all the way down, right? Yep. All right, cool. Do we have um? Uh... Oh, hey, because we need the cobble anyway. <laughs> hey. <There you> go. <laughs> it all makes sense. Where are we gonna get the cobble? Oh, <laughs> sweet dude, cheeseburger. I don't know why. Cheeseburger. Ah! Is there something here? Oh, we're fighting now. Ah, I'm over. Oh, we don't want to break the bridge. Uh. Don't rock the poop. Uh. The rock the boat, baby. Uh, hey man, you saved the day. Oh hey, I can't pick Paco. up. I can't uh, pick up these. You're very uh, reactionary. I can't. I can't pick up these cobblestones. I'm is full. Is inventory full? <laughs> yes, it is. Away. I can't. There's my personal stuff, and then there's my work stuff. I don't like to put, mix put my ink with my pen. Put like put some of it in, in this it. um this thing right here. All right. But nobody can steal my wool. Because it's mine. Don't touch the wool. Um, what? Do you need some wool? No, I, I just thought I'd freaking creep it. I might let you borrow some wool. <laughs> if, it's cold over here, so I might need some. Yeah, see? Alright, you're right. Can't be oh, stingy with the wool. My mother used to sing to my grandmother and li literally rock the car. My grandmother hated it so much, despite my mother just messing around to rock the boat. Yeah. Oh, oh. rock the boat, rock the boat, baby. Oh my god. Don't tip the boat over. It's like, ah. rock the boat. Oh god, we flipped the car. <laughs> <laughs> we flipped the car over, rock the boat. Why are we flipping in the air four times? <laughs> well, oh, is that where the booster's gonna go? The mm -hmm. boost? Yes. Okay. Uh, I might need to go chop down a tree, but guess what? I brought an axe. We have plenty of material for everything. Yeah, wood around here. Yeah, gonna... check the check yes, the mine carts. I gotta go and check a mine. We have a tree right everything. There. <laughs> check the carts first. I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna go chop a tree down. Chop it down a tree. Run. Hey Juan, let's go close the deforestation <laughs> nation. Let's do it. Yes, I'm all all about that. Yes, 
my yeah. I, my regular Minecraft world is very deforested, and it's yeah, not very it's good like, for nature. But it's these trees are in the way, though. It's like <laughs> these trees are in the way. We need all this wood. Get rid of all of them. So hmm? there will be trees that are proved to be taken down. Oh sweet! And, and I will let y'all know. Damn. There's one that's already getting on my nerves. Oh, how about this foreman over here, eh? <laughs> there's a crafting table. There it is. Okay. <laughs> yeah, there's a right. there's a crafting table at every entrance and outrance of the tunnel. Outrance is that a word? <laughs> it is now. Yes, in uh -huh. this world we have plenty. We have plenty of new words. It's it's how you get in and out. What else would you call it? <laughs> I feel you. <laughs> All right, give me these sticks, man. Sticks, man. We don't need powder at the moment, right? No. We or don't concrete. need the... Wait, what? Mm -hmm. We don't need concrete powder or any types of concrete, right? No. Okay. Oh, man, things. I might have too many pickaxes now. Oh, God. What? Did you shift create them? Uh, maybe. Oh, did I just lose a bunch of sticks and stuff? Yep. What the hell? <laughs> the game just stole a bunch of cobblestone. Uh... I thought I told you about that. Yeah, but I thought it was something else. I didn't, no, I didn't it's know. it's exactly it was... what you just did. Ah, no. <laughs> That's frustrating. So uh, my hot fix, they haven't fixed that yet. Uh, can I talk to an admin? I want to get my gear back. <laughs> I don't oh, think man. it works like that. Man. It's... Well, it's not retroactive. What kind of patch is that? You know what? I don't need maps right now. Uh, yeah, okay. Just keep on my guess. Uh, we have plenty of wood. Just show some of the some problem solved. Yes. Sure. I want you guys to know about my stash of fish. So that's going to be a secret. I wish I had a shovel. Man, I can't believe that. <laughs> And as soon as I pushed it, I was like, oh, wait, is this that thing? Because <laughs> I was expecting it to pop out of me. You know how like it used yeah, to? It was just, like, bloop, and then there's stuff to, on the floor. It used to fall on the floor. Yeah. Right. Yeah, now it's just like, and it enters the void. <laughs> like, what? Where did it go? Like, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> the game's like, where did what go? What are you, what are you talking about? <laughs> there's nothing. The table will swallow things. Okay. You lost a bunch of sticks. I lost a bunch of wooden blocks. I lost <laughs> sticks and cobblestone, dude. Cobblestone. <laughs> <laughs> I was making stone tools and I lost half a stack. Oh, half the cobblestone that you just mined? Yeah. Uh... <laughs> and now I'm picking up a bunch of dirt. Like, uh, this is a nightmare. This dirt is That's why I do it one by right? one and my, I just wait and I slow it down. Uh, you and your old school way. So you do that one by one, but when you build concrete, you you build like four towers tall. That doesn't require a uh, crafting table. <laughs> I can just build uh, it up and be fine. Gotcha. Gotcha. And it's not going to just disappear. No. You'll just <laughs> die and well, go might, climb it up again. It might disappear, but that'll be because of my network. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's true. Not because of I glitch. might die a bunch of times. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, wait. wait a second, did I go too high with that? Uh, no. 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 Okay, yeah. No. I would say check back. It's back, so uh, we have space. I should really be using a shovel for this job. I think there's a bunch of wood at the castle. If what about this tree trouble. right here? Hmm? This tree right here, it's kind of like... Let it's already see. missing a bottom one. Let me see. <laughs> yeah, that tree's in the way. Yeah, sweet. I got this. And if you want to, this tree right here is also in the way. Which one? This one right here. Okay, cool. I kind of wish I could like 
use a spray paint X on the trees. Yeah. <laughs> Cut this one down. Yeah, like dude, that would be. Gully. Yeah, just like how they, yeah, they would, how they would really do it. Mark this one to be cut. That'd be so cool. Yeah. The dark side. All right. Oh my Nothing. god! And then this black oozy glob will start appearing. Yeah. It's not then, very healthy. And then it takes over and starts eating fern gullies. <laughs> Wait, that's not what they were called. <laughs> Where are the fern gullies? No. No, you're not. Man, there has not been... Ah. I'm going to go make a shovel. This is silly. Yeah, because I think it actually breaks your tools faster. Oh, man. Uh, Major Pink so says, just mine out the second block stump and put a red wood block in its place. Hmm. That would make sense. That would definitely make things interesting. Ah. Or, even cooler. Alright, this that. chunk is done. We need it over here too? Wait. Yeah, we did. Wait. What? Oh, you just took the trunk? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Take uh, the leaves too. <laughs> well, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Those leaves aren't even there. I do the right? same thing too. Uh, the, it's... Oh, yeah, the, and then the, it's the, like the leaves. Two listen, listen. And then the <laughs> leaves the leaves break down over time. And yes, yeah, exactly. after like. 20 days. I got plenty of stuff to do anyway. Like, it's to a feed. The <laughs> apple will be right there. The whole reason why I said Listen, it's in the way is because you weren't supposed to see that. The way. You weren't supposed to uh, see Hey, this. Deep, do you want some wool? Because I have some wool over here. Uh, is it on a sheet? Uh, no, but I have it. <laughs> I have it in the chest. I'm asleep. Listen, if it's on a sheet, call me. I don't want just wool that's just lying around. <laughs> this is yeah, weird. Quit switching the mouth. <laughs> My bed's too far away. There we go. So yeah, call me if you see them sheep. I'm looking for them. There's one by the castle. He's like, no, oh, sweet. I don't want any of that dead, shedded wool. I need fresh wool. Wool with fresh of the fresh of the better. <laughs> I want my wool still naying. <laughs> oh, jeez, this guy blew up all Wait. over the place. You mean what? buying? Hmm? Yeah, buying. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> naying like a horse. <laughs> I get my wool from horses, didn't you? I want some of that horse wool. Oh, God. Mm. Alright, I'm at the... Oh, I see that sheep. He's about to get sheared. Do you want to keep the coal in here, Taco, or at the castle? Uh, I'd say keep some here for torches. Okay, I'll keep the rest. I need to look and see if there's a quick way to get some, like, I'm kind of hating torches now. Why? Because uh, they're ugly. You gotta get those glow blocks. That's what I'm thinking, but in yeah, order to sea do... lanterns. <laughs> but, oh, There's, uh, Taco has a love hate relationship with sea lanterns right now. Oh, what's wrong? What's wrong with sea lanterns right now? I have to sit my guy. Basically, I get one sea lantern an hour. What? Why? Because bed <laughs> bedrock my mine bedrock guardian farms suck. Oh. So we need seven hundred and sixty for the castle. Oh. Which is twenty four days. Is here. Twenty four days. That sounds like a nightmare. Yeah, <laughs> it is a nightmare, <laughs> and I don't know how to fix it. Keep the so, shovels here as well. Um. Mm -hmm. You're a skeleton. I got three wool added to my collection. I'll keep the sticks here as well. I 
think they're gonna end up having wool stairs soon. Wool stairs? That's so weird. Like the fluffiest <laughs> house ever. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, uh, how flammable that stair would, stairs would be. I'm gonna have to call it a night, guys. But thanks for having me on here. It was All a blast. Right. All right. See you later, deep. Have a good yeah. one. Have a good He's one. Stop shooting me. Yeah, it's a good one. How you like a thing in your face? Oh, this thing's sweet. Yeah, I need to get. I, I think you need it stronger. Yeah. It took three shots, and this bow would have taken them in one. Okay. <clears throat> uh, oh. Oh, no. What happened? He has a ton of the material. He, oh. Do you want gravel taco or no? Gravel? No, we're not doing anything with concrete. More power. More power indeed. Um. Okay, so I can just get rid of gravel? Yeah. Okay. Actually. Yeah, if we ever need it, we can go into the ocean and grab some. We're going to need the... um. The uh, what are we gonna make the spire out of? Conduit. Um, oh, we're gonna need the conduit for the yeah, yeah, a conduit, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, um, they're they're fairly easy to make. Um, I think we have a few hearts of the sea, and then we have tons of non the shell. Yeah, I'm trying to think, thinking is hard at the moment. <laughs> um, I can drop all the sticks here. Cool. Alright, I don't need torches right now. So food. Uh I don't need this right now. There you go. No, not that. Um, cobble is what I need. Yeah, perfect. Uh, alright. That later and then come back. Hey, Cortana, roll a die. Three. Right. Uh... What? Okay, would you rather A, live... Switch lives with a dog every time someone knocks on your door, or B, switch lives with a cat every time a light bulb in your house burns out. Um, I'd rather switch lives with a dog just for like that pure excitement every time someone's at the door, because <laughs> cats are very indifferent. So, dogs I feel like have more emotion. I mean, sure, I've had cats very, very emotive, but. Sometimes I'll just like sleep, but with dogs, it's just like, oh, someone's at the door. Like, there's like that burst of excitement, I guess. So. I, I guess I'm like, are they saying would you switch lives with your dog when the door is not? I, I guess. I don't know. I don't have a dog, so I can't really switch lives at the moment. But if there was a dog anywhere, I guess. Um. Because, yeah, I, I guess I don't. The excitement wouldn't really tie in because you might switch with the dog, like, <laughs> a different part of the country. Yeah. And then, you, I mean, you'd be able to visit other places, but only for five minutes or so. Yeah, I'm like, when would you switch back? Because mm -hmm. it says every time. So I'm like, until somebody actually answers the door? Because I'm like, then wouldn't wouldn't the door be answered by a dog? <laughs> <laughs> if the dog even understands how to answer a door? 
I feel like if it has, like, if it's you inside the dog, then I feel like you would not, like... Because you would teleport somewhere completely different and take mm -hmm. over a dog, and then that dog would transport into your body. That'd be weird. And then it would be confused, and then the person would knock again, and then they'd be like, ah, whatever dogs are saying, ah, ah. And they wouldn't really know how to open a door, I guess. Yeah. That'd be kind of weird. <laughs> Just like you, your body transports to the dog, and the dog transport the body's the dog's body transports to you, and whatever you're doing at the moment, it's like. I... You come back, it's all chewed up, and <laughs> things are all knocked over. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody really knows what happens to you. They're yeah. just like, please don't knock out the door. They, oh, so okay. you're here. Rah, 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 rah. You're like, God dang it. <laughs> you have to go calm him. <laughs> you have to go calm him down. We're like, hold on, hold on. And then you'd answer the door, and then they'd you'd calm down. Like, oh my God, what just happened? <laughs> <laughs> don't worry, he's just going through a phase. It's. <laughs> He's just, I don't know, very <laughs> weird at the moment. Did you not read the sign that says don't answer, the, don't knock out the door? Like he has a condition. <laughs> it's a very weird and specific condition. <laughs> we haven't a figured condition. out <laughs> figured out what it is. I think you would just change, change your door. Like. <clears throat> to what? Actually, no. I was thinking about changing the doorbell from this. Um, that wouldn't apply at all, actually. <clears throat> there was this. Uh, <clears throat> you alright? Yeah. This TV show called um, Switch, it, Switch It at Birth. And, like, um, some of the characters were hearing impaired. And, like, instead of having a doorbell, they had a light bulb. Oh, yeah. I've it. heard about that. Yeah. But I was like, that wouldn't. Knocking. <laughs> I'm like. You can't do that for knocking. That's not. That that, that doesn't. That's not the same thing. So, uh, um. Yeah, you can't really stop somebody from knocking. Unless you have like a soft door. <laughs> Major Pink says no one reads anything you post on the post door or anything. They do the complete opposite. That's very true. <laughs> Uh, I think it was the H3 podcast. And um, <clears throat> there was this person who ordered a pizza. Mm -hmm. And on the door it said, um, don't knock, just holler for Sharon. Oh, I, I saw that. <laughs> He's like, Sharon! Your pizza! Oh my god. Yeah. Terrible. Yeah, I saw that. It was pretty funny. <laughs> yeah, I think it was Domino's too, I think. Yeah. Oh, man. Like, some of those requests are kind of dumb, but sometimes they, like, it, like, it's pretty amusing to watch. Yeah, some of the ones that I see, because I only, I only see, like, um, I see them for, like, packages. Mm -hmm. Like, um, my grandmother's in a, not a, it's an apartment complex that seniors are in. Mm -hmm. It's not, like, it's, like, limp, like, they won't let you move in. If you're not a senior, ah, um, because they're trying to keep it, to, they're trying to keep it like a specific type of community, so they can, um, I think they get like senior funding. citizen retirement home, but apartment wise, yeah, and like they, I'm pretty sure they get like subsidized a little bit to mm -hmm. be able to charge charge what they charge for it or something like that to get senior citizens a discounted rate or something like that. I don't know how it works, but I'm just assuming, um. <clears throat> Yeah, I like on that. I'd see stuff like, "Oh, hello, Mister 
Mr. UPS man, please leave the packages at the door, at the office, or something like that. <clears throat> or, um, I see a sign that said, like, no soliciting. Right. But, uh, yeah, other than that, I don't see any, like, specific instructions. Like, don't knock, yell. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you know what they say about assuming it makes an asset of you. <laughs> uh, also, like if you point, like if you point, like there's like three bullets in the chambers. Like oh. you're, yeah, I don't know, it's something like that. <laughs> um, it's something dumb like that. I think, yeah, I, I, I don't know, something like that. I don't know. So. Hmm. Um, but, yeah. Uh, man, I'm gonna need a lot more stairs. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, that was switch. It's coming together slowly, this railway. Oh, yeah. Um, so, I'd say it'd kind of be funny, like, if I was visiting somebody that had that, mm -hmm. like, doorbell condition, because you're, like, uh, you're like, if you knew about it already, you're like, if they didn't tell you, and then, like, somebody knocked on the door, and then all of a sudden, one person, you're like, rah, 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 and you're like, what the <laughs> He's like, I think I'd go and I'm gonna <laughs> be like, uh, I'm gonna see you guys later. <laughs> but, um, yeah, like if you do about it and they're like, you have to be like, what? I don't believe it. And they like, okay. And they show you like, that would be kind of funny. Um, like seeing something that you just have, you have to see to believe. Mm -hmm. Um, that would be funny with the dog and it'd be kind of funny with the cat too. Cause it's like. <laughs> Normally, when a light blows, it's nobody's in that room, and it's right. And you're like, oh, okay, let me go into this room to do something. Click, and all of a sudden, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> completely stop what you were doing until what the light gets, the bulb gets changed. Or I guess if you just notice it, it'll be like a couple of meows, and then I'll be like out of the body for now. I yeah. hope it's not like permanent. Well, yeah, I'm thinking it would be um, like just like with the door, like it would be till somebody answers the door, or mm -hmm. for the thing of like, uh, or until until somebody puts another bulb in it in the um, spot. Um, so in that way, I would I don't know, cause like with the with the light bulb, it takes longer to change a light bulb than it does to answer a door. So with the cat thing, you'd be what stuck What type there. of light bulbs are you using? Huh? What type of light bulbs do you have that takes, it takes, like, it takes a while to, like, um, So you'd have to go like get to the light bulb. Um, oh, that's true. That's true. And then take the other light bulb out, put the new bulb in, and then turn on. Or the, with the door, you'd be like, hello. <laughs> <laughs> that's true. <laughs> It's like, oops, my door is locked. Give me one second. And you have to peer in, like, peer outside to see who it is. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so I'd say if somebody's there with you, then you wouldn't, you wouldn't, like, changing back from a dog would be quicker. Mm -hmm. And changing back from a cat would take longer. But that's if somebody's there with you. If, if nobody else is there, then you kind of just stuck. Yeah. And it's gonna be a mess. <laughs> uh, Cause like the dog or the cat don't know where they are. There's like a different dog or cat every time. Uh, sometimes you get an aggressive cat. Sometimes you get an aggressive dog. It's it's just a mess. Um, <laughs> uh, actually held a lip bulb and my hand popped. I did not scratch me as bad as you might think. My thumb was grazed. Um, I've never actually I've held light bulbs as they were after they broke, and you can hear like as you shake them, you can hear like everything that went wrong, I guess. But oh yeah, the um, was it filament? Yeah. 
uh, cats are assholes and make my make my brains out. I can understand this brains out, but I have cats at back home in Jersey, and they're awesome. One's a little grumpy, but she's getting old, so I, that's kind of understandable. Um, but yeah, I've had good cats all my life, um, except for the cat that peed in my backpack, but that's because he was old and couldn't control his bladder. But um, yeah, that was the whole thing. I think I told that story before, but I don't um, remember. Yeah. Um, but uh, yeah, we uh, we used to have like back in my old uh, house, um, our backyard where there's always had like cats, like stray cats and stuff like that, stray animals, and we would have like whole families of cats sometimes, which was kind of cool. But at the same time, it was just like we we found this old old cat like really old cat like that had barely any teeth and was always grumpy and just like his bladder was going so he would pee like huh yeah he would pee like in the most random places he would go in the kitty litter but at the same time he would he couldn't control it so um he would just pee like my stepfather's like shoes and briefcase and just like he would always have to be like super careful um and then one day i was it was before school and i was talking to my mom about something and uh oh, no, yeah. but yeah I, we were, I was talking to my mom about something and i see my cat the old cat on my backpack and he liked to sleep on and like he liked to sleep anywhere he could mm -hmm. but for some reason i didn't nothing it didn't click that he might have peed in my backpack so i as i as i turn i see him like jump off my backpack and i take it to school and I'm, i grab it and everything's fine uh i go wait outside it's everything's a fine heavier than normal yeah, yeah. Why is it so like? Why is it dripping? Um, <laughs> um, um, I go outside, wait for the bus. It's fine. Everything's fine. Uh, I go inside the bus. Everything's fine in the bus. But as soon as I, like, we had to always wait outside, like in the hallways for class to start and stuff like that. But um. Uh, like people kept mentioning that, like, what is that smell? And I was like, I, I smelled it too. And I was like, what is that smell? That smells awful. And not thinking anything of it. And then we go to class and I set my backpack down and I open it and this wave of smell, just like, what happened? And I reach, I look in my bag and everything is soaking wet. And you know when so you have those moments? Steamy. Not steamy, but it was just like soaking wet because it was cold outside. So oh. it was like during the winter time. So it was just like oh, oh it was cooled down by then. Yeah, uh. but um, so I reach into my backpack and everything is like so wet. And you know when you have like you know like who did it and just like you know who did something and just like uh, I know what's happened here. But <laughs> like that scene that you saw is like that was kind of out of the ordinary plays back in your head. Yeah. And then I had to go up to my teacher and I like I washed my hands first and then um I went up to B teacher and was like, Yeah, my I think my cat peed in my bed, uh peed in my backpack. Um and she kind of looked at me and was like, Can I call my mom? It's happened before. Um, so my mom I called my mom and she was just like um, I called my mom and she was just like, what, really? He's like, yeah, I think this is what happened. And she had to talk to tell her boss that um, her cat peed in my, her son's backpack and her boss was just like, just go, just just go. But so I ended up having like to carry like, a, I think a trash bag for a backpack for a little while. <laughs> uh, but I don't know. It was not a good day for me that day. But yeah, so and then yeah, it uh it's a cow. I don't want to... no. But yeah, um it was not a good time for that cat. Okay. Um Taco sounds so miserable hearing this story, yes he does. <laughs> um is so, it that time? Hmm? Is it that time? I was trying to make sure this question was 100% um, done. Because, uh, 
This is an interesting one. It's fun. Yeah. With multiple different <laughs> different things. Um. Oh. Oh. Uh, we cool. have a uh, block of redstones in this chest over here. Sixty-four. Yes. I'll bring I'll bring it over, and then yes. I guess we can end it there. Yes. Um. Okay. So, um, which one would I choose? Because both of them are funny in their own ways and there's one thing I have in my house that makes me choose the other one <laughs> if I didn't if I didn't have this one item I would choose the opposite one so for you which one would you choose I think I would choose well after talking about it for a bit I think I would choose the cat because uh, it's not as uh, obnoxious as a dog just constantly barking. Hmm. I don't know. Okay. I so, would choose neither, but... Um, so yeah, so I would, um... Yeah, I would say... I would say cat for three reasons. One, um... Light... No, 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 no. I would choose the dog for two reasons and a cat for one reason. Um, mm. I would choose the dog because when somebody knocks on the door, everybody hears it and mm. somebody's going to answer it quickly. Right. Um, if they're home. Um, for the for the cat one, I would say another um, reason why... No, no. The dog, dog because gonna answer it quickly um and the cat you'd be just stuck because you would you would like go into a room and then you turn into a cat or you, your body would turn into like act start acting like a cat and then somebody would be like where's where'd taco go he went to go get something out of the other room and he'd go in there and he'd like crawl around right <laughs> like oh this oh it's a... taco going through a phase it's all right <laughs> he's a cat again would he have any bulbs and it like it's even if it was quick, it's it's quicker for the door. Mm -hmm. The reason why I would choose the cat, even though it's quicker, is because I have LED bulbs everywhere. Mm. My bulbs are rated at 20,000 hours. So it would be very, very... Ah, so very, you're gaming the system in a way. Yeah, it'd be very, very seldom that... A light would blow out in my house. So, I would pick cat because I have LED bulbs. And if I didn't have those, then it'd definitely be the dog because that would, when it's I feel like it's more fun. <laughs> um, I don't know. What if you get transported into an old dog? That just you, sounds so sad. Because you're like you just be doing something here, do do do, and all of a sudden you're like. You're like, oh god, everything hurts. <laughs> Somebody, <laughs> Somebody help me. It hurts so much. Uh, I just feel bad. And then you come back, you're like, oh, it was an old dog this time. Oh no. Uh, I still got my first ever dog, Boxer, and four years old. I love Boxer. Boxers are awesome. I have a friend that has Boxer, and he doesn't even know his own strength, but it's just like he's just he loves everyone and everything. Um, dog on his deathbed, that's never fun. Uh, like if you have yeah, that's that's gonna be a bit sad. Yeah. Here you go, Taco. Alright. Uh yeah, I have space. Oh, I can put them in. Yes. I already did. Yes. I already did some of them. Yes, and I think there's like three or so three or few or but there's some at the castle, so cool. Um. Yeah, it'll be a while. Well, I don't know. It's like you used up almost ten of them just <laughs> getting from where it was to here. Uh, um. Yeah, we're gonna have to do some underground mining things eventually. But mm -hmm. um, yeah, I think this is a good place. We did quite a bit. Yes, we did. And this, or I'm think I'm getting close to done organizing. 
bunch of stuff over here as this well. This is not really I, need to, like... I need to go through like each chest and just be like and start organizing stuff. Okay. Yeah. But, yeah. I will do that on Friday. Yeah, we're already well within the like setting up the the shell for the second one. Yeah. Ah, oh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, I was saying if Taco went dog and it was with a dog. Yeah, that's, yeah, I understood that. Yeah. That would not be fun. That would be pretty sad. Um, but yes, I'm going to save and quit just in case. Uh, but yes, today we learned about uh, the types of jazz. Uh, three types of jazz. That would be... Um, uh, and famous abstract artists. And the part to the digestive system. Digestive <laughs> system, yeah. Um, but yes, let's go visit someone. Let's go raid. Let's see who's online today. Where is my oh, I didn't turn off the text. Uh, oh, oh, that is uh, Not many people are on today. Uh, today is Wednesday, right? Yeah, okay. Um, many people are on, but let's visit Loser Man Wins. He's playing some Guitar Hero 3. Ooh, look, one's on. Huh? I, what'd you say? <laughs> I said, ooh, look, one's on. Oh, yes, I am on. Yes, you should raid me. And I, I'll raid you, and then it'll just be <laughs> like... Both of them will cancel. It's just like a big <laughs> train wreck. Everybody go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right ouch. all right everyone i am the chosen one thank you all so much for hanging out uh i'm sticking on both of you all oh yeah it'd be it'd be interesting like oh you're gonna raid someone it's like oh it's one it's like oh you're gonna raid taco it's like oh and all mate it's all weird one weird area but yes I am the chosen one. Uh, thank you all so much for hanging out. Thank you all for following. Thank you all for lurking chat. Thank you all for talking chat. Thank you all for donating, either the bits or the money. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you all for the raids and the hosts and all those wonderful things. You are all wonderful. You're all one million and you're all one of a kind. I really, really appreciate you all. I won't be doing a stream in the morning because I work, but I'm thinking of doing a stream in the afternoon because there's the D&D show uh, uh, late in the, on Thursday, so I might want to do that. might want to watch that, so I'll do I stream in the afternoon, but we'll see how that goes. Um, but yeah, I'll see you all later. Bye bye. All right. Well, yeah, we got we got quite a bit done today. I'm, uh, yeah, I need to, I need to go ahead and scout. Um, once we get this railway into the castle, um, which will probably be what two more streams. And it should be built into the castle. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I need to scout which way we're going. So, uh, I may do that over the weekend, depending on what all happens. Got a little birthday to attend. And, uh, got some editing to do. But other than that, yeah, I'm gonna get ready for next week. Um, yeah, because uh, I don't even think the spire's on the map. We didn't even map it out, did we? No. We yeah. went there, but we didn't, like, plan it out or anything. Okay. I think I did it through off of, um, off of, uh... World Atlas. Yeah, my, mine Atlas. Mine Atlas, yes. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and, uh make some maps for it and all that. Why is this all water? Anyway. <laughs> um, yeah, that's it for today's stream. We'll be back on Friday for another edition of Minecraft Power Hour. Uh, after the stream, we're going to be hosting um, Silent Scale again for those who want to watch some more Minecraft. Um, but uh yeah thanks again to Major Ping for the follow and um 
As always, this is Big D from Takiyaki Gaming. Today with me was the Chosen One. That's and, me. And Deep India dropped in for a little bit. And uh, like, thank you all for hanging out in chat. Thanks for let's see. <laughs> thank you all for watching. Thanks for hanging out in chat. Thanks for supporting the channel in any way that you do. And I will see y'all next time. <laughs>